Hello, our names are Sophie, Tanner and Ruby. We are students from the Kerbal Public School, which lies in the traditional land of the Wonga Pawani Yampa people. Every year, National Reconciliation Week is held between two significant milestones in Australia's history, the 27th of May and the 3rd of June. But we would like to firstly share with you some information about the day before the commence of National Reconciliation Week on Tuesday the 26th of May. This week we celebrated National Story Day. This Conciliation Day was held in Sydney 1998 and is now commemorated nationally to remember and honour the stolen generation. During the 20th century, the Australian government policies resulted in Aboriginal children being separated, often forcibly from their families and the interest of assimilation. On the 26th of May 1997, the Bringing Them Home report was tabled in Parliament. The annual National Story Day commemorates, reminds and raises awareness among politicians, policy makers and the wider public about the significance of the forcible removal policies and their impact on the children that were taken and also on their families and their communities. The, the commencement of National Reconciliation Week starts on May 27, which is also a very important celebration for Aboriginal peoples because it is the anniversary of the 1967 referendum in which more than 90% of Australians voted yes. To care Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people in the census and give the Australian government the power to make laws for Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islanders people. Up until 1967, the Aboriginal peoples of Australia were only counted in the Australian census under the Flora and Fauna Act, which meant they had no rights in their country where their ancestors had lived for thousands of years. National Reconciliation Week involves forming positive, positive, respectful relationships between the broader Australian community and the Torres, Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islanders people for the benefit of all Australians. It's about creating positive changes and therefore we need more people talking about the issues and getting involved in contributing to building and reconciled Australia. National Reconciliation Week is a time for all Australians to learn about their shared, shared histories, cultures and achievements. June 3rd is also significant to Aboriginal peoples this week as it is when we celebrate the historic 1992 Mabo decision in which High Court of Australia recognised native title. This was to recognise the rise of Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander peoples had over their lands that were claimed under British colonisation. So what is National Reconciliation Week? It is about commemorating two significant milestones in the reconciliation journey, the successful 1967 referendum and the High Court of Mabo decision respectfully. National Reconciliation Week is a time for all Australians to learn about our shared histories, cultures and achievements and to explore how each of us can contribute to achieving reconciliation in Australia. Reconciliation must live in the hearts, minds and actions of all Australians as we move forward creating a nation strengthened by respect full relationships between the wider Australian community and Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander peoples. So as you can see, we are proud of the achievements our people have made and would love each of you to celebrate National Reconciliation Week with us now by standing and participating in a minute science to remember the stolen generation, to remember our polite in reconciliation and also to celebrate the great country we live in Australia. Please stand quietly. Thank you for listening to our speech.
you for listening to us speak about Reconciliation Week from Cobar Public School.